as the Missouri River winds its way across the Dakotas, it feeds a number of large reservoirs where walleyes are considered king, along with fantastic angling for big northern pike, abundant smallmouth bass, and an exploding crappie fishery. The Red River, stretching from about Fargo, North Dakota, on up to Lake Winnipeg in Manitoba, is hands down the world's finest channel catfish fishery. Huge numbers of cats in the 20 to 30 pound range ply its murky waters. What may surprise you though, is how many big walleyes exceeding 10 pounds are there for the catching. The St. Louis River and Estuary at Duluth Superior, along the border of Minnesota and Wisconsin, hosts a great spring and fall walleye fishery, along with good numbers of bass, panfish, big pike, and trophy muskies all year long. As the upper Mississippi River flows from northern Minnesota down along the Wisconsin border, it changes from a small, rocky river supporting trophy smallmouth bass to large river and reservoir environments with strong populations of big walleyes, ponderous catfish, giant pike, largemouths and smallmouths, and some of the best panfish fishing around. The entire length of the Wisconsin River Stretching from the northern end of the Badger State down to its junction with the Mississippi is a hotbed of walleye, smallmouth, and muskie fishing, with big cats and even paddlefish thrown in for good measure. In Michigan, the Saginaw, St. Clair, and Detroit rivers are best known for seasonal runs of huge Great Lakes walleyes. Yet there are many smaller rivers, particularly those flowing into Lake Michigan, where huge walleyes also lurk and where seasonal runs of Great Lakes steelhead and salmon draw anglers from all across the upper Midwest. Small rivers feed big rivers and both have opportunities for catching lots of big fish, plain and simple. They deserve far more angling attention and respect throughout the year than most anglers afford them. So if you're on the lookout for new water, give them a try.